So we're on the learning path here with SQL, and we're building up to doing this deal here with a database. But in the previous video, we were talking about whether or not case matters in SQL, and we tested it. And in the test, we saw that I created the table with this, this kind of case, and then when it was in SQL, it was like that, so it just made everything lowercase. But because in some programming languages, case really matters. So we're just going to check it one more place. Does case matter in SQL? Uh, SQL keywords are case insensitive, but are often all written in all caps. However, in some setups, table and column names are case sensitive. So in some setups, they do have case sensitivity. So some implementations. All right. So we've created these two tables, and if you want to get to these notes, if you are somewhere in the world that's not this classroom, here's the link to that note, those notes right there. Hey, er, er, my mouse does not work because Mac was designed improperly. Now we're going to insert data into the, that table, and then we're going to insert data into the recipes table, and then we have this. All right, so we have a table recipe classes and a table recipes. So I want you all to now create this database if you haven't done it. It's copying and pasting. It should take you about three minutes. And, uh, and then I want you to do an inner join on this data. And I want you to pull out recipe class description and recipe title. And if you get stuck, you can look at the answer, but try to do it without looking at the answer. Go!